In the last video, I talked about a new jump series, Sakamoto Days. I will put a link in the description and on the top right if you guys want to check it out. Continuing the topic of new jump manga, today I would like to talk about another series titled Ron Kamano Hashi Derange Detective. Ron Kamano Hashi Derange Detective is a Shonen Jump Plus manga by Amano Akira, who was the author of a very popular manga called Katekyo Hitman Rebound which even has an anime adaptation having a whooping 203 episodes. Derange Detective is a story about the duo of Ron Kamano Hashi who is a private detective with some serious issues and Totomaru Ishiki who is pure hearted but dim police detective. In the beginning of the first chapter, we are shown a detective academy called Blue applauding and praising a student who has just solved a murder mystery. The praises are very high and the audience cannot wait to see how this particular student will solve mysteries once he graduates. And right after we are shown that the particular student was none other than Ron Kamano Hashi himself. In the next page, we skip 5 years giving us an impression that maybe things didn't go the way they intended. We are now introduced to our second main character Totomaru Ishiki who is struggling in the police department and people around him keep telling him that he is incompetent and not suited for the detective work. Then his co-worker Kiku-san suggests Ishiki to meet a certain private detective who can help him in solving this case. Ishiki of course takes the suggestion and goes to meet this certain private detective. As always, I don't want to spoil the first chapter to you, so I will stop at that. It's quite refreshing to see a detective manga in Jump, at least to me, as we hardly see any new detective stories pop up given we already have the detective story giant. Detective Conan. The art of this manga is spectacular. Like look at this color spread for example. Does it not look beautiful to you? I am totally digging the art style here. And while I like the different cases that have been shown so far, I kind of found their conclusions to be a bit underwhelming when compared to the whole case itself. Maybe it's because of the saturation of tropes by Detective Conan but so far the cases have been pretty okay though far from something mind blowing. Don't get me wrong, I am enjoying the chapters. The pacing is good, the art is brilliant and the story is engaging. But I think there is one missing piece which I hope will eventually be covered. At the time of making of this video, there are 6 chapters out on Manga Plus app with mostly 2 chapters per case which I think is perfect pacing for detective stories. And so this is another manga that I am following right now and let's see how that goes. This concludes my first impression and recommendation on yet another new jump series. What do you think of this manga? Was it entertaining or not? Let me know in the comments down below. If you enjoyed the video, do consider leaving a like for me as it helps me get this video to reach out to more people. While you're at it, check out my other videos and if you like them as well, do consider subscribing for more such content and I'll see you guys in my next video.